I'm an addict for sneakers, 20s of Buddha and bitches with beepers in the streets I could reach her Yo, what's up YouTube, it's your boy Nature Real OG, often imitated, never duplicated, bring you the best one piece of the game! Yo, before we go any further, make sure you hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and ring that notification bell so you can stay in tune with everything that we got going on. Bro, I got a Travis Scott Jordan 1 giveaway. All you gotta do is click, click the card, right? Follow the steps, and you good. Come on, let's go. So, I went to St. Louis to this store that I've been holding this gift card for like a while now. And I've been, it's been burning a hole in my pocket. I've been dying to spend it. So, I made the trip from Chicago to St. Louis to go ahead and pick up something with this gift card. Your boy got these joints right here. Boom! Nike box. I'm going to show you guys what this is after this part. But... Let's go ahead and talk about this shop that I went to. So the store that I went to is Reset St. Louis. I believe they have two locations, one in St. Louis and then the other one is I believe is in Kansas City. I'm not really sure. Anyway, yo, if you're ever in St. Louis or Kansas City, this shop is a dope shop, man. Really cool people in there, really nice. Uh, the guy that I was speaking to up in there, I'm not sure who he was, but he was like behind the counter. Really nice guy, made me feel really comfortable. Um, it was like a real warm experience as far as like going inside the store. Even gave me the opportunity to shoot some B-roll inside of the store. So I'm gonna show you guys that right now so you can know what I saw. And then we're gonna go to the surprise pickup that I picked up. Obviously you know what type of box it is, this is Jordan 1, but can you guess what Jordan 1 it is? Let's go. Man, this is gonna be fire. Check out this B-roll. And then we're gonna go ahead and get to these shoes. Let's go. Think about back in the days when it was 89, little nigga on the grind. Gotta get my door. My crime with two in here instead of stacking my ears. Put my serve down on the clear nine nights. Hitting up the grave, y'all shit with real little wheel, big wally and wish bones. Little wally and high rope, little zany, what do I nigga so strong? Crazy bone, stack right, take much love. Kept a nigga on his toes in the game. It's an everyday thing when you let you the tank. Gotta make it grand at least daily, man. The Cleveland hustlers, living no busters. Look to the heartbeat of niggas from the land pool. And the old school, just serve out just with us and be too fucking with truth. Rest in peace to the nigga, rest to stress that bone. No smoking no wood, cause a nigga moat up, calling up my niggas when it's time to do it. In the nine, nine niggas don't drop to the number one, but you got so run, run. Cleveland is the city where a nigga come from, slagging them down. Just going run. down, up in the same town, in the buck with a thug, and a nigga with the bug, and the fifth for rose. But the niggas don't know nothing about what the fuck it means, a nigga roll up the boot up. So how'd you guys like that B-roll? Man, really dope store, right? Dope store. But I know what you want to know. I know what you want to know. What did I pick up? I picked up these joints right here. Let's go ahead and open the box. Look, everybody, a little box. You want to see what's inside the motherfucking box? Let's see what's inside the box. I got these joints right here. Boom. L.A. to Chicago. Jordan 1. So I know what you're thinking. Bro, didn't you already have that pair of shoes? Yes, I did. I let them go. And I just, I was feeling some type of way about it. I've been feeling some type of way about it for a while that I actually gave this shoe up, especially with me being a Jordan 1 guy. I had to get these back. And you know, they kind of like, I don't know, I guess like, so anybody that knows me knows that, you know, I'm a Laker boy all day. Been a Lakers fan forever. I bleed purple and gold. Plus my uncles are cute, you know, so they wearing purple and gold. And that's just, that's just been in my life, like forever. Like, like forever, forever. So I definitely had to get these joints back. I needed them back. Was not gonna rest until I got them back and I was able to get these back for a pretty good deal, actually. I would have just bought them outright, but I ended up trading a pair of shoes for them. Uh, I can't believe the pair of shoes that I traded, but I am gonna get that pair back because that was a used pair of shoes. Also, I traded a pair of, I traded my black 750s uh, for this pair, a used pair. Uh, they were pretty in good condition. Um, I think we made like a good deal anyway, and then I ended up paying like, I guess, $200 uh, for the shoe. So, 
that's uh with my uh with my gift card also so i i think it was a good deal i don't know you tell me if i lost or not i don't know but i'm glad i got these joints back bruh man yo i really hope that this store was not affected by like the riots and everything that actually happened in st louis um i've seen pictures i've seen like footage and stuff of things that's going on down there and a lot of things got destroyed down there and i really hope that they were not one of those places um yeah man i mean i know it's been tough out there for everybody i know a lot it's a lot going on you know what i mean me personally i had to take a mental health day uh it was just so much going on especially here in chicago especially on the west side of chicago um and certain neighborhoods it's like it's like turning into like a a race war and uh yeah i know and i know it's a lot of things that you probably can like really uh you know you rather i know that you're worried about it and it's not sneakers but I just felt like, hey, yo, let's give a video, you know, the last video I did with the on, you know, just the on feed, I didn't even do it the right way because I just wasn't really feeling it. Um, but I had to do this video so that we could take a moment and, you know, it's probably just kind of escape reality and maybe I put a smile on your face. Maybe you get to see something new that you didn't see before. And, you know, maybe you will end up traveling to St. Louis when you have some time and then going to go check that place out anyway, anyway, anyway. Thank you guys for rocking with me. Yo, the positive feedback I got, man, is just like, yo, Hey man, we're all one people, man. And yeah, that's it, man. We just gotta. I don't know, man. It's it's tough, man. It's been real. I've been real bummed out, and yeah, that part. Anyway, thank you guys for watching the video. Please make sure you like, subscribe, comment, all that good stuff. Holla at you guys later. Peace. Can't see